So how does that feel to you that you have basically the last footage of both these men's lives? I mean, how, what kind of responsibility do you feel that places on you? And, and did that affect you during the, the filming process? I mean, it's... it's well, I, I, the responsibility that I felt through all of the project was we're handling people's lives. You know, even the villains' lives. These are the lives. And, you know, even though Chivarella took the money, he shouldn't have taken the money, he admits to taking the money, he admits that that part was wrong, he may never admit to kids for cash, but he also destroyed his family, his entire family, and his friends, and all of it. And they have to live with his legacy. And, you know, it, it, and, and I think for us, we just wanted to have an honest portrayal of the stories. And we, we said that we were not going to take anything anybody says out of context. We had 600 hours of footage, and you can always take and flip when you're editing, you know, somebody, something that's something a reality shows, that's what it is. It's a constant flip of what people say. So we had to make sure that we, we stayed true to all the stories, and, and we did, and I'm very proud of that. And, and literally, from the journalists to the families to the judges' daughters, no one has come to us and said, we got it wrong, we took something out of context, no, that's not right, that's not what I meant. No, no one has, has said that, and I feel really good about that.